My new favorite part of that whole clip is the ouch. 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 Oh, Ooh, yeah. yeah. Ouch. Yeah, that had a hurt. And yeah. convinced me to get a gun. Steven, New Jersey. Well, that's just wonderful. Oh, good, good for you. Good, good, good. Good Arm. for you. The one, uh, I like our new um, attorney general yeah. saying that in order to uh, keep the crime now. Um, from running rampant in Mexico. Yeah. Uh, that we're going to completely, you know, throw away the Second Amendment and uh, ban uh, certain weapons here. That's that's wonderful. Is this the best of? Legal weapons. Is this the best of? No. Because okay. now this stupid fucking Attorney General... Not banning Mexicans, is, though? ...is using... Yeah, not banning Mexicans. <laughs> <laughs> First of all... <laughs> banning guns, but not Mexicans. Right. First of all, do you I honestly think... Do you honestly think <laughs> yes. that... That I do. People are going to gun stores, buying what is you know called an assault weapon, which is just a fucking joke of a name uh, to scare people. It's a gun that looks cool, but it's like any other hunting rifle, uh, semi-automatic. Mm -hmm. It's not a machine gun. Mm -hmm. uh, do you really think the Mexicans are importing the expensive fucking guns from the United States, or perhaps shit from South America and and wherever else? They could uh, afford to buy. No, I think they're buying them from guns. some guy in Texas. <clears throat> Do you really think they are? Absolutely, because that's Bullshit. where Mexicans live in Texas. Mm -hmm. Bullshit. They're buying some cheap shit guns. They're buying some good American-made fucking guns that cost two thousand dollars a clip. You bought a two thousand dollar gun? Of course I did. Why wouldn't I? What's the most expensive gun you have? Two thousand dollars. <laughs> <laughs> now, probably uh, the Desert Eagle was about. Twenty-seven hundred. A Desert Eagle, I, great gun. We talked about it oh, before, but I, I enjoy that gun. Fifty caliber. You shot a Desert Eagle, Patrice? No, I enjoy. It. I only seen enjoy on looking at it. Yeah, I've never shot a gun. Yeah, before. you're like me. It's movie guns they look cool, but I don't know how to shoot them. They use that in a lot of movies. That gun. And how are you supposed to shoot a Desert Eagle? You got to hold it straight. And... Yeah, you got to hold it straight. You can't limp wrist it. You no, can't, one like, hand. Fly that thing. You one can't one do hand. It. One hand. You can't do it like gangster style. Nah, you can't. Where you hold it to the style and go like this, and your hand go like that. Nah. That'll you got to hold pretty off. straight. You can't even flip your elbows up. You got kind of back, back with your uh, shoulders. Turn That's a gun jams. Turn up your headphones. Oh, it's you got your headphones? Away. Yeah, there's something wrong with that, that headphone jack. A lot of people saying that they can't hear when they are in that spot. Well, got to fix it for Patricky. And I got to give you the other side of the argument today because what? There, there was, uh, <laughs> and and please, uh, you know, sarcasm Not in right. my voice because people don't understand sometimes. Uh, four shootings in 24 hours in East New York. Now, you know, you get some of these guns off the street. Uh, boy, are we going to have uh, four shootings in 24 hours in East New York? No. You know what? Because I love that. Because in East New York, every time I go to the gun store in East New York right, and old. legally buy guns <laughs> in East New York and then walk out of the shop, right. um, I usually end up in some kind of a shooting. Do you honestly, <laughs> do, do, you, do you think that is legal handguns? Yes. So legislate against the legal gun owner. Look, we disagree on a bunch of things, but I've got to tell you something, my friend. You yeah. turned me around on this uh, gun argument. I love guns. You really did turn me around. I, I was one yeah. of those rah, rah, let's get some of these guns off the street <laughs> type of guy, and then I... Uh, I I was educated by you on some of this stuff. I think you're still oh, like, like like I still think you're obsessed with guns and all that. No, but I, 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 it's like any other hobby. I enjoy them. But you know the, there are hundreds the bad guys of gun are control get the guns. laws. There are hundreds of gun control laws already. And what are they doing? They're, they're, Why they do don't work so with crime. Guns? Attaboy, Attaboy, Patrice. I enjoy Attaboy, Patrice. collecting guns. Why can't someone collect? People collect fucking thimbles. Why, why don't they you? Jerry, what you, Jerry Seinfeld collects deal. cars. Don't collect the bullets. But I need the bullets to shoot through the gun. That's like Jerry Seinfeld buying cars and no gas. He he yes. dri likes driving you his cars. What? Fuck it. He doesn't just. He likes Colin Quinn them. pushing his cars he, down the yeah, street. He doesn't strap a car to himself when he walks around the house. You fucking kook. <laughs> well, uh, only sometimes when I'm down in the theater now because there's no exit. There's just one door. 
Mm-hmm. If I get a home invasion, they walk in there. That's true. Oh, you and this home invasion. Would you please? What? It hap- oh, it never, it never happens. Just put Look gates. up home invasion in uh, uh, Long Island. Just put and- gates on your windows like I did. Oh, that's good. It'll look like fucking South Central. Oh, man. Every I, house in South Central I looks put, like a fucking jail. I put I Am Legend gates on my shit. <laughs> I Am Legend. Damn. Can I ask you a question about this home invasion thing? Oh, yeah. How are they going to invade your home uh-huh. when the lights never go out? That There's is true. always movement and action in your house. How the fuck are they going to well, home invade uh, your house? It just has a silhouette night. of a man that just goes on a yeah, track. It's on a track to make it look like someone's just pacing at night the whole time. Uh, home invaders don't care. You got their lights are on. Off. In your house no, I got an alarm system. You know, that, that door opens up. That alarm's gonna fucking go off. Really? And shit like that. Yeah. So why do you need guns also? Because uh, I don't have the alarm set all the time. Sometimes when I have guests coming over, like last night, there was a poker game at the house. Talked about it on the air. Hence the poker. Things flow. like that. Do you think I I want somebody thinking, hey, there's a poker game going on at Anthony's? You know, I might be able to score a little bit of cash if me and my buddies kick open the door and fucking, you know, raid Anthony's poker game and grab his cash. They don't know what my buy-in is. But they know the listeners. What are they going to get, $40? Yeah, exactly. True. <laughs> oh. <laughs> if they, so so if that ever happened, I'm, uh, I'm packing uh, what they call heat. And, uh, you, you know, stop, I'm TCB, as they say. TCB. You want to shoot care somebody by mistake, man. <laughs> no, I'm very safe. I'm a very safe gun owner. I'm very responsible with my guns. Yeah. Always yeah, know if they're what? Do you have a, do you have oh, a, yeah, they're uh, all say hello away. to my little friend gun? Uh, I have a very close one. I don't have a, I don't have a grenade launcher, but I do have, you a, have, one I that, have two of those. That if your sister, um, bipods on them, tries to come and fuck you, and then a Mexican yeah, shoots yes. her in the back. Yeah, yeah. And then you go to try to get that gun, and then you look at her and talk to her for a minute. I talk to her for a, a little while, give her a kiss, tell her to launcher. stay there. Give a little don't kiss. move. Don't move. You know, scanners. So you have a... What's your say hello to my little friend gun? Uh, that would be my um, AR-15. It's uh, got the bipod on it. It's got a laser sight, flashlight, front grip attachment. Um, yes, it, it's very good for uh, close quarters, like in the house. But When I'd 50 rather... was on, did you have a gun discussion with him? No, I would have liked to, but there was so much other stuff. That guy is a business man. That man knows his business. You should have talked about them guns, man. I would have, but he... that man shot nine times. Probably doesn't want to discuss guns. AR-15. No. He's wrapped. I, I've heard AR-15s in a in a yeah big rap gun. AK-47s though is like the the nah, gun of the that home was, boy. Nah, rap. That was the that was that's yeah, old school. Yeah. That's eighties mid eighties. Yeah. Cool Mode D had a fucking AK-47. <laughs> cool Mode D. <laughs> fucking the educated rapper. And I hate when anyone talks <laughs> Glock to me. Glocks are homie passe. guns, man. They're just homie guns. They passe. Yeah, they're so passe. It's just AR-15 is in a very recent rep. Uh, yeah, I gotta, I gotta find out. Do you like the AR-15s? Nice thirty-round clip, pre ban How about like a nice snub nose thirty-eight with a with a grip? I don't like what they call a wheel gun. I don't like the revolvers. Well, I like excuse automatics. Excuse me, motherfucker. I like automatics. They're fun. Boom, 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 boom. You're very um. Yeah. You know. I like that shit. You're very classy about your pistols. I, 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 I really am. I like that. I have a little drawer uh, that I open up and I accessorize. You got any uh, of those little, those depending little, on what I'm wearing. Uh, that, like a hand, the hidden one that comes through your fingers and you can... No, nah, nothing like that. The smallest one I have is a uh, Walther PPK, the James Bond 380. That's a nice one. A little silver gun. Damn. Then I got the 1911 um, uh, 45. My night table gun is a SIG 45 with a laser sight on it. That's the gun that stays on my night table at night. Wow. So that way, loaded? if there's any shenanigans, fucking A loaded. What are you going to do? What if you have a dream and just, just shoot that's yourself in the you. foot? That, see, that's why I can't be a gun owner. What am I going to have a dream and pick stupid. up a gun? I don't even fucking... I'm just... Man, what if you like? mistake it for your Alka-Seltzer? <laughs> <laughs> Alka Seltzer. Yeah. How do you fucking mistake a gun for Alka Seltzer? You go plop plop, and by the time you hit fizz fizz, your skull is all over the ceiling. <laughs> <laughs> he makes a mistake and blows his follicles out. And you have to start all over. <laughs> it's a it's a, a fun hobby. I like target shooting. It's a lot of fun. You're not. This is not a hobby, though, man. You're a yeah, what? Do a jigsaw no, puzzle. It, it's two, it, it, it takes care of two things. It's a hobby. And it's, uh, you know, protection. And it's my goddamn right as an American to uh, own them. And no one could tell me uh, different. 
That's how I feel about it. Second Amendment. The speech, and then they thought that one was important enough to make number two. Well, oh, guns. Speech. To Fucking shoot whoever makes an unpopular speech. Exactly. That was made up, man. <laughs> like, come on. 1760. Well, let me tell that you something. That was back when guns were a little less dangerous and couldn't kill oh, everybody you know what? at once. That's a good well, argument, me, though. You know what? It's a great argument. Until you think of this. They're trying to ban semi-automatic weapons. They have been around since the 18 fucking hundreds. What? Without anyone saying, we got to ban these. They're too fucking modern. Tommy guns? And now, not Tommy guns, not shit like that. You know, you, you can't a own a machine gun. gun. No, nah, you're not allowed to own fucking full automatics. I could buy a Tommy gun semi-automatic, but you got to pull the trigger every time you want a bullet to come a out. A semi-automatic. just like... Da, 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 da. Yeah, you're not allowed to own a machine gun. Then why did Capone have one? People think, because he was a criminal. Oh, People think that you're able to go out and buy machine guns. They think an assault weapon. They, the the Democrats and the liberals, they've done such a good job at fucking lying to people and making them think that people can go to a gun store and buy fully automatic machine guns that they call assault weapons. You know what an assault weapon is? It's a hunting rifle Take that has any gun. <laughs> cool shit on it. It makes it look cool. Instead of the wood stock... It's maybe pla black plastic uh, that, that uh, it looks like a military gun. Okay. Uh, it's got a uh, nice scope on it, a nice little uh, ACOG scope or something like that. Why? Um, and then here's something they don't want that they, they consider an assault weapon that they don't want you to have. A bayonet lug. Because how many fucking bayonet charges are people hey. killed in? Hey. Man. After you use up all your bullets, you, now you, you're going you to need stab something. a motherfucker. Now you're going to fucking charge into the fucking uh, liquor store. In case you're fighting Huns. It, it, it's that. It's things like um, a folding stock. They don't like the folding stock because I guess you could conceal it better. But these are all things that like legal gun owners wouldn't do. It's people that don't own legal guns that do this well, it's fucking just shit. It's not necessary to have so many. Nothing's hats. necessary. Your hats aren't fucking necessary. Sure they are. They, they keep are. the rain off. Why them. do you have so many different hats? You need one fucking hat. Why? It's not dangerous unless it's the same hat it's not from dangerous. Goldfinger. Your car's fucking dangerous. Oh, <laughs> odd job's fucking hat. <laughs> yeah, watch that shit. It's not dangerous. It's just you know yours is the, you have a dangerous hobby. It is not dangerous. Guns are not fucking dangerous. Your hat is dangerous. You, you, you treat them nicely. The home that nah, I hate knives. Fuck knives. What am I gonna do? Step up to someone and stab them? Fuck that. Sure. I'd love to see somebody with a knife and then you pull out a gun and go ha ha. <laughs> <laughs> it can work. I hate knives. I don't think most people need guns, man. What? I think it's dangerous. I am. I am. I, think a, you're I am just a white as man. Dangerous. You're. 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 How you have dangerous? daydreams and kooks, but most, most, um, mm. most dangerous shit happens. White people. Here's the thing, for real. Mm. Dangerous white people kill everybody. Dangerous black people kill. Da uh, black people. No. Dangerous I, white people decide that they're gonna 48. fucking shoot everybody in the Toys R Us. For no yeah. reason. We have quality of crime of murders. You guys have quantity. Did you just fucking say quality of murders? Yeah. We have quality of murders. You have yeah. quantity. Yeah, yep. really? Yeah, we got like the... Fucking every high school, every yeah. McDonald's, That's every I mean. diner. Some yeah. people, How often is that shit old happening? people sitting in a diner having some heart, how some hail and hearty often, hail or whatever the fuck they How have. often is that happening? A lot. N bullshit. Every day you look at convenience store footage, you every, see some homeboy every just day pulling out a rifle on somebody. They show you convenience store footage, but every day they don't fucking show you some sickening white guy who shoots up his guy. Do he you got think fired. how he cool got fired from his job? People would love to see that. And got fucking sh and the shot. The news up would show time. that in a second. It, it happens all the time. The news would show that in a second. Black people don't just kill people. You watch randomly. first forty-eight. You watch first forty-eight. It's the first forty-eight hours of an investigation of murder. It's ninety nine point nine percent black people killing other black people. There's a and the point one is what is Hispanic. <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen a white guy on this show. I don't understand. All I want you to do is take credit for your sickening crimes. You eat people. What? Eat people. You kill poor hookers that have nothing to do with nothing. They're just trying white to fuck criminals. All right. All right, white criminals. White I thought you were talking about a big fucking black uh, pot boiling in the jungle somewhere. White murder. Or just white yeah. murder. White murder is pretty uh, gruesome. Gruesome. Because there's like reasons for it. You guys are just, oh, you stepped on my foot. You. Let me shoot a three-year-old and uh, the grandmother walking by because I can't hit my fucking target. I, 
a three-year-old stepped on my foot and I shot no, him? No, no. Some guy steps on your foot. You pull the gun out. You try to aim for him, and you hit grandma and some fucking kid in the playground. You just made up a black crime. It doesn't exist. That's exactly, it happens all the time. You're telling me Did little Laquisha you know never what? gets shot my, in the playground? My fucking girlfriend uses the word all the time, all the time. She said, when she's explaining some shit I did four months ago, she says all the time. All right, literal, you, Patrice. I don't mean all saying. the time. You don't say all the time. I mean, okay. People say most of the time. It happens very Some often. Very, very rare. Very rare. White guys kill their wives a lot more often than black guys. Because black guys don't. Oh, I was going to say, well, black guys kill their wives. <laughs> <laughs> I had an answer for that we one. We don't. <laughs> we tell our wives to shut the fuck up so we don't have to choke them to death <laughs> or put them in a the freezer or feed them to some. Why, why do you own pigs? This is what I'm saying. White guys should feed, not only yeah. to feed your wife. It just, it just. I just want you to take credit for a lot of the shit that I we say, should be afraid of. Uh, uh, of what you do. Let me put it to, put it to you this you're way. You're mass killers. The just say odds, you're mass killers. Yes. Tell Whitey, me. Whitey is mass killers. But mm. let me let me tell okay. you something. Fair the enough. odds that you're gonna walk around and get killed by a white serial killer, <laughs> or the odds that you're gonna walk around and get killed by some uh, a black thug. The black thug uh, is, is so much more higher. Absolutely. Can't be. The crime stats, black on white crime is three times more that's than white on black crime. That's an absolute I got that from false. stormfront.org. You nah. got it from the racial <laughs> those pieces of shit? <laughs> Stormfront. I got that from AryanNation.org. I have one of those guys as my friend. Do you? On MySpace. <laughs> really? I, I was, when I was uh, hosting your show, he goes, I, I go, hey, yeah, I'm going to be hosting the show. He goes, why should I listen to you, Sambo? Oh, my Whoa. friends. He Jesus. And then I wrote back, holy shit, Sambo? I had to laugh when I heard that. That is old school. That's stuff. some old school shit. That's like Moon Cricket. <laughs> <laughs> moon, moon Cricket. <laughs> Pieces of shit. Uh, I, I'm, I'm so fed up with white people and your fucking yeah. new upsetness. You're really sick at me. I'm very upset with uh, black people in the uh, yeah. same old, same old. Same old, same old what? That I fucking turn on the news every convenience store, you know what I'm every you? closed circuit convenience why, store. Why do you? Why do you what? not? Why do you take hmm? the side of white people and you're not white? I am white. I'm considered when I fucking when I buy but a pistol, you, I check you, white, and they don't go. You're not white. Why do you take the side? And they of make white sure all the time? because I'm white. You're not white. I'm wh I'm European. Exactly. Italy is from fucking you don't Europe. Have anything to do with why black and white people don't like each other in this country? Uh, exactly. So why am I hated by black people so much? I, mm. I, I try to tell you, and Boy, you don't listen. I'm listening. I, white is like Hitler's mustache to black people. It's just what you are. It's a symbol. It's a symbol. We we don't look at you like the oppressor. Well, well, well. Stop taking oppress. <laughs> stop take being personal when black people say white. They don't mean you. But you're but a fucking eggplant. Uh, your great great grandmother slept with a more. Here he goes with the fucking true romance speech. Yes. <laughs> Give me my Chesterfield, nigga. <laughs> but wait, if, if Anthony's in East New York, those guys are going to look at him. They're not going to go, all right, he's yeah. not the man. They're going to hey, go, go, he's a cop. I guarantee you. Well, where, 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 wherever. You walk, through, you walk through East New York, <laughs> black people are not going to bother you in East New York. Well, they may think he's like a, a local on a, 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 some type of a, a weird. Guatemalan or something, <laughs> some fucking, That's what I'm saying. some swarthy heroin dealer. <laughs> That's what I mean. You do, you do look like the um, boss on a video game. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the boss mob on you, a video game. You really game. don't. You're not a white guy. Opie looks more like a white guy than you do, like a traditional white guy. But you don't look like a traditional white guy. That would that would not stop a criminal element. From trying to uh, uh, do me harm or, or take uh, my money. I, I think an Italian would be more apt to do something bad to you than, than a black person. The fuck out of here. My person has never done anything to you. That's the How thing you know? that's fucked up. Never. You don't, you've never put yourself in a position to be ha have anything done to One you. One time in the guy. fifth grade, it's I broke news. someone's thermos against the tree. What? You, and, you and, did something bad to and, a black and person. The, no, no. And the glass uh, shattered in this thermos. Mm -hmm. And. Um, and because uh, I just wanted to hear the glass break. So I went back to class and I'm up at the blackboard figuring out a, uh, a little problem. What? And the door what? opens up. What? The chalkboard. Oh, uh, go ahead. And uh, <laughs> I, I'm figuring out a problem. And the door swings open. And there is the principal, the woman, mm -hmm. and this young African American boy. Mm -hmm. And all he did was look around the room, looked at me, and pointed at me, and then walked away. 
and then I got so dragged actually, into the office. Actually, he was helping to stop crime, <laughs> the crime that you was committing. And ever since then, that motherfucker ratted. People. That motherfucker ratted that me out. That nigger rat. He ratted did the me the right fuck out. Thing. Did the right thing. He ratted you, me you, out. You was a rotten. A kid, he actually told him you like, like he was supposed to, and ever since then you haven't liked black people. When I was in Central Islip, I, I'd get shaken down for uh, lunch money and things like that. Black kids would rob yeah. you for your lunch money. Give me fifty cent. Be, give me fifty cent. Give me fifty cent. <coughs> I'd be like, oh shit, I gotta give him fifty cent. She said, no, thank you, I don't have it. And they would do what they did to you. <laughs> what? Fucking with your your hat. But but he doesn't fucking he doesn't he doesn't, he doesn't dislike black people. Right. I don't either. You hate black people. I love you. I think you're yeah. great. That doesn't count. That Why doesn't, doesn't that count? You like black person. Yes. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Why does everything have to be poor? I'm, I'm one of the good ones. According. I want you to like all of us because we really, we really aren't. A de for for what for what we went through in this country. Oh, here we go. Holy we shit. We should be hijacking. What? When we were fucking on Conestoga wagons we, going to the west? We should be hijacking mm -hmm. everything and just driving and flying things into everything. How and long? And we're not. How we've really never fucking done anything. long? We've never done anything to this country. Is this grudge? What? What? You haven't done anything I'm to this fixing country. fixing these papers. Do here you understand to you that we the have tax not burden? That is 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 on, on this country what the fuck because are you of talking about. Why would you even say some shit like that? What do you mean tax burden? Fifty percent of the prison population is African American. Is that do you know fault? what that costs? That's oh, because that's why he's fault. Uh, for, for, the, uh, poking that's at you. because Bernie, you know what that Bernie Madoff is going to get uh, six months. Guy should have his head in, locked in off his, in his house. Guy should have his head fucking cut off. And I have no the, problem with that. The crimes that young black men commit. They mm -hmm. put you in jail for a long time. And why is that? What murder? Well, no. Fucking rape. F drug dealing. Armed rape. robbery. Most, most of I'm us. I'm not talking about some guy selling a little weed. That's, that's fine. That's who's in jail. But that's who's in jail. Oh yeah. We're not overwhelmingly murderers and rapists in jail. It's overwhelmingly drug dealers. Mm hmm And the drug crimes are crazy. And the drug, and the drug culture. Crimes are racist. The drug culture. You can is, have a fucking kilo of cocaine and, and, and do less time in jail than having a fucking a vial of crack selling it. It is what it is. Yeah. Yeah. And white guys are in jail for not, for the major shit. Murder, armed robbery. Same thing. Yeah. There's too many people in jail in this country. A million of them is white, but I know it's disproportionate. But it's disproportionate black people being sent to jail. I'm not trying to victimize it. Yeah, Let's that's just always say the excuse, but, Can we just say yeah. this? Right. There's there's some um there's some legislative racism. Let's just can we admit it? No. Can we just say that it's unfair? Do you think this country's fair to black folks? And, he, and, he, and, and unfair to white people? Like the, are you No, no, I'm not do saying you unfair. white people to go with that? I'm not saying unfair Be to white people. Be I'm reasonable. saying that uh especially in this day and age. Be reasonable we're vilified way more than we should be in this country. Be honest. You know something for a people who when live, I start seeing live with a color that mm -hmm. is very has been very nasty in in the least to to us we're we're quite friendly and in until, terms of what we should be in this country we should be insurgents because in country, only we're not. because because over the years uh it's only gotten better and better for better uh, black people because somebody You're said you president because somebody said you can't hang me it got better see that's what i'm saying uh, the, that's one step here, but see that i mean to tell you the truth to be honest the, with uh, fair enough but here's my problem before he became president, mm -hmm. um, and quite frankly, let me explain something to you also that he's not. Um, this is this is a, the fact is Barack Obama being the president is a testimonial to how racist the country is. Wow! I'll tell you. Listen to me, because he's Bold not thing. black. He's not Compton black. He's not Bronx black. He's a fucking African. Who was raised by white people, mm -hmm. but he's black only by his color, because Africa accepts him as their own. Right. Africa doesn't look at him like he's a black American. They look at him as a first generation. That's what you should see him. They, I wish I was here when DL was here. They get on the news and they go, you, "We look at you, <laughs> look at you, niggas. You, you've been here fifty generations, and we have done nothing. <laughs> we send you a president." <laughs> <laughs> Filthy fucking Africans. And 
But the reason he's black is because of his color, not because of what he's been through. And and that's how that's why this country's so. Are you shitting up. me? Have you read his that's fucking book? Why have you have you have you listened to his the speeches? The experience of being his skin color uh -huh. makes him black in this country. That's what I'm saying. This country's so racist that just because your skin color and you're fucking not white, but you embrace white, you if you're white because of your skin color, but right. not really because of who you are. You're not from whiteness. What You're am I an fucking immigrant. wearing my uh, uh, pants around my ass and an fucking immigrant. bling? Yeah, but I could say that you, you know, that you eat squinjili and fucking blah blah blah, <laughs> and you fucking <laughs> stale You're fucking this. You're a pan. And, you and you shake down this and shake down that. I'm not well, a I fucking Aryan, but yeah. I'm, I'm, you know, Anthony you may not be, be white, but his hood is. <laughs> <laughs> You're a hundred percent Italian, Anthony. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. And uh, Italians have nothing to do with whiteness. You're, you're Are you black? out of your fucking you, mind? Hey, listen, you're Nappy, trying to make the whole planet hey, black. No, I'm not. Fucking Nappy Arabs are black. Negro. Arabs are black. Stop it. That's they're what, they're that, Arabs. All right, here's the thing. They're yeah. Arabs. Why don't you give Arabs Jesus like you should? Well, I think we have. I think we pretty no, much. No, you haven't. No, you no. haven't. No one's given. Why won't the Catholics you can't give, take down all those crosses why, in church and fucking why spray paint them? Get the Catholic, stain it's out. Easy, just fucking paint over it. Why won't the Catholics? Give Arabs Jesus in the least. Why? Uh, I don't know. They fucking uh, got used to the That's white guy. White is right. That's why it's, yes. it's a racist country. Just stop. Sorry that the made-up fucking fairy tale of Jesus, uh, the guy isn't fucking. Uh, he is a uh, real white. human being. All of a sudden, How do you know. Oh, okay. So when Come he on, looks like stop. Saddam Hussein, he's he's a figment. But when he looks like. Uh, Rob Seeger. <laughs> like a, <laughs> he looks like, like Ted Tom, Nugent. <laughs> Tom <Benning. laughs> he's a fucking. He's he's a, he's an actual existing human being, right? That's what I'm saying. Just stop. All we want to do is uh -huh. have you admit that there is racism. See, the, the thing is, it's hard to talk to you because you, you you're an admitted racist. I just want the disproportionate amount of crime to stop. That's all I want. <sighs> How much crime so all I want. can black people actually I want to be commit. able to relate to we black people more. We don't commit that fucking much crime. I want to be able to relate to black people more. It's only a few There's people. such a different culture that I can't relate. I want to show. relate. I can't. No, I can't relate. I, if I went you to a party, black friends. if I went to you some fucking, let me say something. If I went to some fucking house party mm -hmm. where hip hop's fucking blaring and and, and uh, guys, girls, fucking dancing, shit like that, mm -hmm. I would be so fucking out of place. Not out of hatred. Okay, so if I but came over your house and it's just no, a bunch of quiet white boys playing, you know, poker white people better than not, I know black people. But that's what I'm saying. It's it's the, it's the same thing. I I'll go over your house and it'll be you and fucking Danny and somebody else j drinking yeah. and being dead serious playing poker. And I'm like, where's the bitches and where's the music, you fucking losers? But that's your thing. That's your thing. Yeah. And the women will be wherever the fuck they are, somewhere doing coke at the pool, and <laughs> and you guys will be fucking drinking beer. And I'll be like, can you somebody over my have, house? Can somebody have fun? That's what I'm saying. It, it's it's not like. You know, there's pit bulls <laughs> and fucking and fucking dice going on at my fucking house if there's a party. <laughs> That's I, what I picture. Norton's been that, at my yeah, fucking house. You should have fun. Like, black parties are always fun because you know when it's over, when someone comes in with a machine gun and clears the fucking place <laughs> out. <laughs> and Norton always leaves my house when all the black, because the white people come exactly on time. If I say three, it'll be all the white people there at three. Yeah, yeah. And then at five, all the black people come. Mm. And Norton has a way to leave at 5.15. Oh, really? Yeah. I show up. I usually have. Uh, I usually have spots, but once once I start noticing, like, all right, I've never done a show with him. I've never done a show with him. <laughs> I, I if know. I don't know if they're fucking comics or crips, I fucking <laughs> I go. <laughs> <laughs> Will you just stop? Stop! I am stop. Stop! I am what stop. am I doing? Your, I am stop. Just stop your fuck. Just buy your guns and fucking stop. What I do. I keep stop to myself. Stop vilifying black people, man. I keep to myself. We're you know, fucking I have more very. Common. We are so. <laughs> we are. We are really. We really love this country. We've done nothing but good things for this country, man. Stop about the peanut. Compared. <laughs> Hey, guess what? Hold the fuck up. Stop the presses. Uh-oh. I didn't realize this. I'm not going to like this. Wait uh -oh. a second. Uh -oh. I'm going to have to have a fact every day. All right. All right. I'm going to call in with a, with a new black fact. Jack Johnson invented the monkey wrench. 
All right, that's just, go. let me fucking... <laughs> Jesus, uh, 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 why would you play it to his head? Why so would shot, you give Jack everybody... Jack would you Someone said, whose wrench is this? <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah. Why would you do that? He oh, you're used, too smart for that, Patrice. He used to... Oh, he what used is to, wrong with He used you. to tighten screws with his hands. Yeah. <laughs> Did and he? he couldn't tighten it. Yeah, that's kind of So he created do. the patent... For the monkey wrench. <laughs> he didn't actually do that. He got the patent. He did not create. He got the patent. He got the patent, which yeah. is the creation of the <laughs> And thing. then Elvis okay, stole saying. it from him. <laughs> yeah, he didn't. He actually did not create that. Jimmy I don't know if that's right or wrong. He's talking about he's lying But again. I wanted to show you how he didn't know if it was right no, or wrong. He, he, he created the patent. All right, can we agree on... Uh, someone stole it. Can we agree that we like porn stars because we got one waiting to come in oh. here? So we're going to take a break and talk to oh. uh, Gina Lynn. Oh. A friend of the show. I'm stopping. Oh. Will you stop? <laughs> and hopefully You're an influence, influential man. No. Stop having people afraid of black folks. We don't do anything. Anymore. I don't. What? Never done anything. Well, not you. Not any of us. Disproportionate number. Uh, disproportionate in jail, not disproportionate of the crimes. No, disproportionate. Crime. I will the, same, say. the same black people that terrorize Harlem. It's terrorizing black people. Look, I'll admit it's. I'll, I'll, well, yeah, there's and a lot of black on black. And there's only a few motherfuckers who are terrorizing. A lot of black on black crime, but um, and we get that from Africans. But we get the, that from Africans. Oh, I know. That's, that's the shit we get from the Constantly hacking each other up with machetes. Genocidal maniacs. Genocide, yeah. I'm not attached yeah. to Africans. They're insane man. over there. Not even fucking. I've with never them. had anything uh, done to me by a black person. Now of that course I think not. About it. Hey, one you punch in the face. You almost raped. Almost raped. Thank yeah. God, uh, you know, he yeah. decided I I was a, a a man instead of a woman, and I and I got punched on a basketball court and knocked out cold. Which is well, you know you didn't add, but see you're an athlete. Anthony's not an athlete. No, he doesn't I, have, you've never been. You've never had personal con. That's another thing. Yeah. Non-athletic people should never be racist I, because you never had that personal contact and and that mano a mano, and you've never stood side by side with somebody of a different. Race and and had to do something for the better cause. You've never had synergy with a black person, and you should get that. Think I have with you. Yeah, uh, you it, it ends right at eleven, though. My, Stop with that shit. <laughs> we're like we're like it that. Gives us great radio at eleven. The, you don't even know he's alive. That punch the clock when <laughs> yeah. they're done. Yeah, exactly. Choo -choo. That's exactly what that relationship. See you in the morning, friend. <laughs> Patrice, my story is simple because I, I picked a sport where a lot of black people, you know, they play it. And you're not in. We and talk shit, and, and you it's stupid in. to say they don't, right? And I would, I, I wasn't talking shit. He was on my team, and he, uh, you got it. You've heard the story. He shot a three-pointer, beautiful, and I turned to him and I called him the N-word because that's what everyone on the court was saying. But you said it angrily pointing. No, I didn't. Oh. I was naive. You said three-pointer, nigger. What? <laughs> uh, I go, nice <laughs> shot, <laughs> because everyone else was nice doing shot, it. Nice shot, nigger. But I, uh, I, learned, yeah. a le I mm. learned the lesson, like, you know, I was. I guess I was wrong. I got was you his friend or you just was on his I, team? I thought we were friends, sure. And I got, the, I got knocked the fuck out. One that, was was, that was out. an unfair knockout, I will say. I'm on I was your side. Out. That was an unfair knockout. Well, you know, I didn't start hitting black people. I, I figured, wow, I got to learn something here because why the fuck? I got to stop watching First 48. I got to stop watching that goddamn stop? show. And the, I mean, I'm scared. And, and the, the web surfing, Anthony. The, fucking, the, web surfing. the web surfing. That's true. The web surfing. That's true, Ant. The web surfing. What? The you don't go to very good websites. That is true. Stop. I go to all kinds of websites. <laughs> yes, I go do. to the black extremist websites. They're crazy, too. The crazy black motherfucker. Which ones? The ones with the Israelites <laughs> where fucking whitey yeah. sucks and this one. and They're reasonable. Yeah, re reasonable. reasonable. Israelites are a lot more reasonable than... Uh... But, Patrice, I, I had to educate myself after that. I was like, wow, why the fuck would he turn on me like that? Well, because he's... Like you know, that. I was checking out David Duke's uh, website yeah. yesterday. He does hate Jews a lot more than he hates black people. I think Jews are, are high up because I, I think they're high up because I, as far as I don't, and, think, I don't yeah. think white supremacists respect black people as much as they respect Jews. Oh my God! They hate Jews no, are number one. Breaking. White white uh, supremacists uh, hate Jews are number one. By the way, I got to go to my bank. <laughs> they hate what? Jews. Yeah, they I, consider I, them like the Antichrist. The, the whole it goes more, a lot deeper. A lot more respect. I think in, in terms of black people, they hate us in in, in a in a very you should be our pets kind of way and you know it's like, yeah they just see it as like the white man's burden kind yeah of thing. and uh but yeah. jews they look at as jews are like the world or whatever yeah, yeah. yeah they they actually think they are spawn of satan ain't that a bitch yeah i got a tinkle watch this market collapse 
It's fucking horrible. Citibank uh, just announced the, that... Has the market had one up day since Obama's Dude, hear been hear me in? out. It's breaking news. Citibank, uh, the government's going to own 36% of Citibank. Is under that the, bad or good? Under the new rescue plan. Oh, boy. <clears throat> watch this market collapse. Let's now, see. this is almost socialism and uh, communism, basically, but is it no, Obama's fault? Breaking false? news. No. Well, this Obama was all, is... This was nice and set up before this motherfucker got Obama's it. very uh, socialist. Man. I don't know what the fuck Bush was looking at. <laughs> yeah, he was... He was busy. This stuff was on the horizon. Yeah, he, he was, was busy like, raising oil oil prices. He was, yeah, and, and he stole about a good seventy five billion before he got the fuck out of here. <laughs> nice, yeah. nice robbery. Yeah, he just took off, man. He was like raised the oil done. prices to about five hundred. Bam. <laughs> now it's back down to dollar fifty, and we got raped for like a good three months, and we don't know why. And it's like, wow, <laughs> back down to dollar fifty. He strange. saw it. He had to have seen this coming. And he did nothing, Bush. He didn't no. give a fuck. All right, let's take a break. We'll get Gina, Gina Lynn in here. And also, Bobo in the audience, baby. Oh, yeah. Cool. David and Bobo uh, going down today. The David and Bobo show, right, Sam? Oh. Yeah. Uh, I think we're going to pop him on the radio right around 11, a little before 11, somewhere around there. It's going to be great. For another 15-minute radio show with David and Bobo. Stick around for that. Opie and Anthony. Happy birthday to you. You can join in anytime. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear. Anyone? Anyone know? Um, Hitler. No. My birthday was recently. Happy birthday to Big Ken and Philly. Oh. My father-in-law. Well, I mean, we're we're buds. But it's hard to be excited brown about that. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> I know. They, these Two guys porn stars just walked in. Yeah. It's hard to get everyone to sing happy yeah, birthday as a father-in-law. As I'm, as I'm trying to get everyone pumped for Big Ken's uh, big... And it's a big birthday for Big Ken. It, it was one of the big ones, you know. Was it? Which F one? The 5-0. Oh, the 5-0. I don't know if he wants people uh, that's, knowing that. That's but, pretty goddamn funny. But a big happy birthday to Big Ken from the Philly crew. I'm sure he's very uh, happy that you're right on his tail as far as age goes. <laughs> Please, I got... What do I got? I got like 12. Three years? 12. Oh. <laughs> I got, he's got 12 on me. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> Gina Lynn, how are you? I'm good. How are you? <laughs> Did you hear what happened? No, what see, happened? We're like bad boys when it comes to porn stars. We ha well, who did we have in? We got to tell her the story. And we were, and, and I swear to God. Penthouse girl. That girl from Penthouse. The uh, Penthouse girl. Well, what's Lene. her name? Stupid Shauna Lene. Who, what's her name? Shauna Lene. Shauna or something like that? But I don't know Shana who she Lene is. Shauna Lene or something? She's a crybaby. Yeah, she ran well, out. She's not a big time name, so. She no. ran out of here crying, and then she made a little YouTube video trashing us. And to be honest with you, we were very nice to her. All we did that she kind of had some kind of uh, problem with. We put a couple of pictures up, we, we found on Google, of her, and it was just a lot of uh, cum on her face. <laughs> <laughs> and she seemed to have a problem with that. Yeah. But it's like... You know, most of, of us girls, we like to have the most beautiful pictures, but when you do a search on us girls, the most nastiest pictures Yeah, but come you know up. what it is? Yeah. There's it's both. just the way it happens. There's, <laughs> there's both, though. There's really hot pictures, and, and you know... Those are the cum shots. No, there's uh, really hot pictures where you're looking all glamorous. Can, right? I, can I say and then something? Then there's uh, the, the the sex part. Yeah, we all know that's out there. I mean, why not say it? Right? Are you, are you trying to interject? Can I say here? something? Certainly, sir. I'm here to promote myself as a boxer, so I don't want to see any black cocks on my forehead. All right. <laughs> are you boxing for real, bro? You yeah, just for real. Around. Yeah, yeah. right. Boxing? Uh, He's behind that monitor. Where is he? Yeah. There he is. Are you an MMA guy, right? Aren't you, don't you do a Wait, you've been you've been on our show. He, he looks like one. <laughs> you've been on our show? Yeah, with her. Yeah. I know. I didn't know you were a, a boxer. Yeah. No, I'm doing the, the Celebrity Boxing Federation. Oh, um, nice. All right. Oh. Good. I'm fighting yeah. Jervis Peterson from Survivor. With your dick? Why are you so fucking familiar? I know. I know you from somewhere. Was you guys on a show where it was like 20... 20 porn stars being take take pictures and they did this. yeah you guys want it together right yeah. oh the book it. of um what is it called thinking xxx yeah and then and okay and, and then hbo picked it up you guys are married you've been married a long time 10 yeah. years and you're not in the game wow though. you hear how she said that <laughs> you're not a porn star yeah. you are a porn yes star. he is well, Which he told a, you do? He told a great story on our show it was him right it was so many great stories do you work with my hero nacho 
No. Or Rumble. I know. He's booted Nacho out of the country. Your, He's booted Nacho... out of the country. He can't come back in. <coughs> Nacho can't come Nacho's back Nacho's kicked out of the country. What did he do wrong? Fucking young I don't brother. know. It, got, it had to be Are really bad. Are you all about him doing the, like, she emails? No, no, no. I like that. That's what he does. He got bored. Yeah. All Nacho did was fuck he does that for you. So I, didn't realize, I didn't realize that until a lot later. But he does. He did one called the cast, where he just was he, a great one called the no, cast. No, he's a good fucker. And Rocco, um, him, <laughs> Rocco. They, I like them. But um, do you ever do any scenes with uh, with black dudes? You do with with uh, like a uh, not together. Jesus uh, Christ. <laughs> easy. He does not do scenes with black dudes. Black black dude. <laughs> Um, I, shit. With, I on did, a girl with a black with, I did with a, your black friend. There was a movie called uh, Gina Lynn <laughs> Dark Side that me Lexington Steel. Lexington Steel. Wow. He's Lexington is the black is the white oh. white woman and white guy approved black guy in porno. Yeah. He, they, he's the one that they will do. But he's like with. got a fucking massive cock, right? Yeah, but he's yeah. he's yeah. kind of like how um, <laughs> yeah, as opposed to small. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's like, like twelve Justin, to fourteen. Justin, they want a lot of white women won't won't do Justin. Uh, Slayer, no? or like uh, Wesley Pipes. Why is that Wesley Pipes? I think I think they want to do <laughs> a lot serious? of white women. Jesus Christ! <laughs> Are you serious with that name? Ah, uh, yeah, it's kind of weird, man. Wesley Pipes. That's Wesley hilarious. Pipes. Byron Long. You like Justin Slayer? He's, he's, he's improved. He's, he's improved. He's one of my favorite dudes, man. He he. How do you improve? I want to. I want to. He improved. He he left uh, one company and went to Evil Angel, and then ever since he's been with Evil oh, Angel, his stuff like, is uh, tech. As soon as you awesome. go to Evil Angel, you're like <clears throat> gold. Well, his oh, yeah. just yeah. the 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 shooting. You're you're, you're more you're porn starish. You're you're at the you're at like. Like I'm not into oh, porn really stars. Like this guy, Patrice, huh? Um, yeah. no, 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 not him. I, I moved <laughs> you on to talk about this guy. <laughs> I moved we to got two really. I forgot we was on the radio. Yeah, he's like, you do black guys. Uh, <laughs> uh, <I know>. yeah. <laughs> Ginger, got Ginger, Gina. Gina. Did, did awesome you just call me that Ginger? Real nice and, Gina oh Lynn. boy, Gina. thank, thank you. That. Gina yeah. Lynn is, is porn starish, where she's mm -hmm. um she's kind of like uh, Jenna Jameson, in in which. Like it's it's normal. You do like you do story still. And you no, do I don't do stories. I'm a Gonzo girl. And in fact, for Ooh. the interracial, you wasn't always a Gonzo girl. No, right? I was under contract, but I was one of the first contract girls that did the big interracial scene. And then all these big companies started following me, putting all these like pretty contract girls doing interracial because they were following me because it was big. Very very rare. <clears throat> I do like JJ. Uh, what's J JJ? Jules Jordan. It That's what I said, Jules Jordan video. Oh, you used to be a oh, Jules Jordan girl. Evans, I, we I'm still not, are. I, he distributes Gina he Lynn make, Productions. He'll, he'll put chocolate milk in a girl's ass and, just, and make, her, <laughs> make her do her name in cursive <laughs> as, the, as the milk shoot. Now, like, JJ is a dirtbag. Uh, Jules Jordan is one of my best friends. <laughs> well, hey, I'm, I'm fucking... <laughs> You'd love him. He'd be fucking... fucking maybe he'd be an asshole, I'm just saying. <laughs> <laughs> and he, um, fucking, um... There's one called Girlvert that I'm a big fan of. Yeah, What's Girlvert. Where this girl that just does horrible things to women. Is that Belladonna? That's not Belladonna. No. Uh, I've never heard of that one. She's a young. She's kind of chubby. It's <laughs> called Girlvert. She has about. I've heard that. I've heard that name, but I don't know. Oh, she'll hit a girl in the head with raw meat. She's a fucking monster. <laughs> <laughs> she's a monster, man. But she does JJ. Uh, JJ. Yeah. JJ. Mm. Yeah. JJ. Yeah. James, James, <laughs> she does. Uh, she does. Uh, yeah, I'm just yeah. G G yeah. And what's your story? You don't talk much. You know, it's like a story. Oh. They're Campari. What's <laughs> <laughs> and, and you're not trying this again, are you? No, <laughs> I'm just a little good Maybe, fellas reference. That's, that's, that's all. I know, I know, but that's yeah. April. Hi, hi, April. April. Hi, nice April. And you. what's uh, what's your deal? That's fresh my deal. breed. That's your deal. Yeah, fresh breed, right? Yes. Oh. It's the only thing she's ever done. Really? And yes. it was only for me. New to the business? She's, very new. Is she's very not new. in the business. Oh, it's what? April. Yeah. You're That's not even in time. the business? No. Mm. All right. Well, pass, you kind of are. Pass them around, know. boys. Yeah. I want to see the fresh breed go. cover. Let's oh, see. Oh, April's fucking oh, Tom Byron, it? who's looking like he's having a heart no, attack. No, I, I fucked Tom <laughs> Byron. Tom Byron is fucking again? I fucked Tom Jesus Byron. Jesus Christ. Tom Byron looks like... <laughs> April only does girls. He looks a little, he looks a little oh, big, really? though. April <laughs> only did me. I only did Gina. Oh, only do, you only do girls. I only do Gina. Someone's licking April. Oh, really? So April is wow, another real first time selective. who loves pussy, as you can see in this pussy fest. Tongue right in the ass. Oh my god, he is getting old. 
Yeah. Oh, Tom Byron looks, looks like a, He actually looks better now. Yeah, he, he looks, know, he looks, he looks you know, like an uncooked roast. <laughs> <laughs> hey, okay, you, you, know, you know what? I fucked him because he was able to keep his cock hard the whole time and get excited. Well, some of these guys can't keep it hard the mm -hmm. whole time no. when they're filming? What's wrong with them? Yeah, it sucks. Chrissy <laughs> Moon is another first-timer who gets railed by Travis, which is you? Yeah. You're railing her? Railed. <laughs> Let's see here. Railed. Madeline is a... Ooh. Too many white girls. Where's a fucking bitch? Where's like a Chinese bitch or something? What's going on with this I, racial I, porno I, shit? Hey, I shoot plenty of Asian girls. Right. Have you really? Yeah. Have you done the, the delicious um, squirter? What's her name there? Um, Cytheria? No, not in Cytheria. She's a, 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 you guys blurt these names out like it's a, a fucking Cruz. Academy Awards. Um, uh, this is amazing. It's amazing. Cruz. Um, Cruz. Natalia Cruz? No, the Chinese girl that's known for squirting. Um, a Annie Cruz. I have no idea who she is. You don't is. know who the fuck Annie Cruz is? <laughs> what Tokyo <laughs> hose? My goodness. <laughs> <laughs> she must be a beat. How about, how about the lovely Jay Fire? Don't say you don't know who Jay Fire. I know her name you've never met her though well tell us who these people are sure. j fire is the expert Let's she's, go. A, she's a black girl who, yeah. who yeah, does she knows who she who is. does white girl things she's moved it usually black girls stay what do you mean by and, white girl things uh white girl movies <laughs> on is, time for the shoot which is on time <laughs> <laughs> and she does usually black girls aren't into um <laughs> fetishy shit things she does she does squirting. She does uh, bondage. Well, you can't choose whether you squirt or not. It just happens. Not really. These <laughs> these girls are fucking controlled. It, it, something's going on. How um, do you know? You're not them. I I fucking because I I work. I know how to make a. I know natural squirting. You you know how to make a girl oh, squirt. I'm a fucking. Genius. How do you do that? Well, you fucking press on the G spot. It's very no, simple. No, that's not how you do it. I, that's how I fucking do it. So I must be damaging bitches. She must be peeing. Yeah, I think she's peeing. No, she's not peeing. <laughs> I, I don't know. No, she fucking, probably is though. I, she's probably she's probably like this dude. She's probably like this dude's making me raw. I'm just gonna piss on him. That's not. I know the piss thing. She's trying to make you feel really good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's trying to peeing on him. Yeah, all right, all right. Sorry. Uh-huh. <laughs> Fuck everybody. I know what's going on here. Yeah, hey. do you? <laughs> Well, that's yeah, pretty this is good. Just, it's just well, let's talk to April. I mean, how'd you get into the bit more, You just decided to go She's in? not in the business. She's not. I'm not. It was really. a one time thing. Yeah. So this one is it. Thing, one and done. It. That's what all, a lot of people so say. That, right? right, Gina? Well, I have known them for a long time. Yeah. And they had asked me several times to do things, and I was kind of shy about it. But Where do we meet you at? We met at the gym many years ago. Really? And I was kind of in a restricted relationship, and I really wanted to do it, but I couldn't. But you might as well now, mm -hmm. right? Well, I did it to kind of get it out of my system. It's like one well, of those still fantasy in your system. things. We're, we're just waiting, your life, baby. We're, we're well waiting for her uh, car payment to be due. <laughs> <laughs> what, uh, <laughs> what, do you do? <laughs> what do you do for a living, then? Um, I have a professional career. Oh, work at an office? Right. Nice and mysterious. Not an office, <clears throat> no. No, no, no. What? Cancer? Cancer? No, you know. dancer. She has no. a very good professional career yeah. that cannot be talked about. Dominatrix? That's no. Right. That's <laughs> no, right. like what? No. Look out girl for bank robbers? Okay, what the a, fuck? A, ma a mainstream <laughs> professional career. Yeah. She's a professional like a real... squirter. I'm gonna go with airline pilot. Or something. Not anymore. It was teaching. Lawyer you office. can't be teaching. Yeah, you're on the, how come you can't talk about it? You're on the video box. Oh, yeah, yeah maybe you don't want them to. What does it rhyme with? Sometimes we don't use our real names. Oh. Yeah, April, but how about disguising your face? Yeah. <laughs> I see you. Well, people know what you... That's she, okay. People know you There's somebody it, right? that's... Wow, awesome. this is very mysterious. They, they have. A couple people have brought it up at my job, and I just kind of... Say it. Blew it off. <laughs> she got put on probation. For yeah, that. yeah, I got in a little bit of trouble for Can it. Can we guess what you do? Oh, law, yeah. law no. enforcement. <laughs> oh, she's a cop. Something in law enforcement, <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah. Are you a nurse? No. No. Oh, all right, so... All right. Uh, lawyer? Sorry. Anesthesiologist. Even if you're gonna say, say no, no. She's just gonna say no. Well, how about can you say what? Can you say what kind of a building? Not a hospital. We'll get but it is it? Uh, <laughs> do you wear a suit to work? Um, I dress professional. Professional. Yeah. All right. You a tap dancer? Yes. Yes, that's it. I'm a big Gregory Hines fan. No. Oh, oh, you're in the media. <laughs> No. 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 Oh, fuck. April likes girls. I think April likes girls more than I do. Gynecologist? <laughs> <laughs> no. I wish. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Perfect professional. Who doesn't? Yeah, sure. I mean, anytime I'm out with her, she's just like eyeballing all kinds of chicks. You know, I kind of like dudes 
a little bit more than girls. I'm very sexually attracted to women. I love them. Yeah, cool. yeah. Boy, hearing this is so <laughs> ew. I know. Hmm. Bothersome. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sarcastic, <laughs> Anthony. Why, why, uh, why, Helly, you were in this restricted relationship, and what happened? Whoa! I got out of it. How long was it? Uh, I know Bam six or seven porn. years. He Bam didn't do the porn. Bam. Just got he just named. He just linked his name. No, he was there and he directed his guy skaters that did some porn with us. Ooh. Wow. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's an awesome movie. That seems fun directing a porno for a scene. Bam goes Gina. Shot in HD. That's Everybody's nice. so quiet. Oh my God. <laughs> We're trying to figure out. You know why? We're trying to figure out what she does. I tell you, I tell you why. I, yeah, I, this I think weird. I really. You you realize something like the idea. You you, you realize you think like porn from being in here mm -hmm. that girls in the sex industry mm -hmm. have the personalities of of um dead ants. Like it, it's uh. you you figure. <laughs> oh my God. It, it makes me sick. I'm I'm getting fed up. You figure like they'd just be like, yeah, we this and that, and it's just like, yeah. <sighs> am I watching a dick in an ass? <laughs> and 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 I I can't get something. It's just bothersome. Yeah, you're getting. I just realized yeah, that you're getting impatient. And I, it really, it's just, it's just. Well, what do you want from these girls? Nothing from them. <laughs> it's right. fine. Right. It's just you just. It's an illusion that you just go. You know, why not just get a girl who who doesn't say she fucks for a living, but she fucks for fun, and she's just wild, f some wild fun. fun fucker, as opposed to this is just just uh, like this is. I'm, so I'm just, what are you I jerk at? off to this. <laughs> so what are you getting? Give me at? something. What do you Give want? Give me something. She's right there. Like I'm, I'm I don't asking you a question. Not what you. Are you not at? you. And I. Not, I, just, I don't want to get. I just. It just. I, I, I don't even. I just. I'm just. I'm just sorry. <laughs> I really am. I just because I'm a fan of porn. Yeah, of course. But it's yeah. almost like these guys have given. It's us almost like meeting Steven Spielberg. You go, I love Jaws, and you just and he goes, yeah, 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 yeah. This whole Bruce thing, I know. Wow, yeah. Spielberg, what Sorry. the fuck happened? I'm a fan of porn. I really Could you am. elaborate a little? And I just want to watch it and pretend like when I'm pretending at home to beat off. Right. I'm beating off on real, but I'm pretend. It's like you pretend like this is wow. This is some crazy girl who. But it's like, what, what is the magic? It's like mm. I'm well, getting fed about up. It. Let's get into this. Oh, little this bit. is a Get me fed up, man. This is a crazy girl that is not trying to get into the porno world. She just wanted to have sex with me. He's not. Talking yeah, about it's her. not even you. No, it's not, not you. It's not you. It's not you. Just it's talking. just in general. This is why when you said that's why I'm saying this because when you said it got quiet. That's what the last time I was here. It's just like girls. The whole sh you have to say dancing instead of stripping, and you have to. And I don't. And and not don't you. Film stars it's of porn yeah, you. It, it's like the I'm not changed. dancing around. Where <laughs> it's like what the fuck? Like I wanna, I wanna talk fucking. Yeah, I'm a dirty, I'm a dirty whore. I, I'm a fucking dirty right, whore. Let's also a dirty whore. Wait, wait, also a guy. Let's get what we're doing. Give you what you want right now. <laughs> no, no, it's not, not Patrice. you. It's, Patrice it's, wants you to blow his friend Jimmy. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what? You know what, Jimmy? That, that's what it's like. Okay, give us the rules because okay, we're joking, but yeah, blow my friend Jimmy. Like not, but every porn star is like that girl shot whatever crying. Yes, yeah, Bitch, you got the dicks in your mouth on TV. What the fuck you talking about? <laughs> Not everybody's like that. There's, a, I know what you're saying because there's a lot of girls that think because now they're on box covers and magazine covers, they're like, ooh, like. I'm not that porn whore anymore. I'm somebody special. I mean, there are a lot of girls like that, but not everybody's like that. I, I know I'm generalizing, but most of the girls I, that I've ever mm -hmm. seen in the game where it's like, it's just... I, well, you brought in... You've talked to the wrong girls. Fair enough. Fair. Yeah. But it's just like Plenty when... I don't know if it was you or... I think it was you, Gia. <laughs> where you go, wow, it's quiet because... <laughs> I was bored. Some, give me some it's, input. It's like, <laughs> but you know, you're here with your husband, so as a dude... See, this is what I'm saying. This is not the... No, but I'm not, here, I'm not here as a husband, My though. husband is the ultimate I fuck pimp. other girls. She fucks other guys. Yeah, I, and I, I film him fucking other girls, and he films me fucking other guys. But it's still, as a, <laughs> as a square dude, which I am, and I'm not a porno guy. I'm a square guy. I'm just a square guy who likes porn. You're still here with your man, and so I 
what? You can't. There's a dude thing. So it's like, okay, here's how it works. You tell me that story, or you tell me the respect story, or the or this or April, which is like, why? I'm looking at your asshole, and you're <laughs> no, like her asshole's not showing on there. Oh no, yeah, on. Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry, on. Fresh breed. Fresh breed fried. I, I don't think your asshole's showing. It's just like. <laughs> Neither one of our assholes. At least give us like a hint. Because we're being. Like, it's like, what do you do? You know, it's like, no, I can't. But you're on. You're, you're, you're in a porno. But see, you're talking about your fantasies and how you can't. You know, how porn is just a fantasy for you. For me, that was my fantasy. That was one of my sexual releases to do that. Something I could have never done. But I actually had the chance to do it, and that's why I did it. That's just a fantasy. All right. <laughs> 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 Makes me feel better. <laughs> Fuck it. Nah. This is why I wish I was Count Dracula. <laughs> yeah. I wish I could live forever, just to see where the young shit all goes. Where when they're eighty. <laughs> yeah, I brought you guys some clothes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that'll kill a couple oh, yeah. minutes. Huh? Yeah, just No, we have our own um, clothing company. I got one for you. Two stores and a website. I don't think that's gonna fit. Who's him. medium? Oh, oh <laughs> I'm more of a... <laughs> my medium. That's no, a good I one like for Patrice. One. I like this one. What does it say? It says free ones. Thanks. Who's large? You're large? Thank you, sir. It, dude, it doesn't let me ask you a question. As a, as a your wife Ooh. does porn, you do porn. <clears throat> Yeah. Um, it doesn't, because I'm so insecure sexually, it doesn't bother you, <laughs> like, just, like, I'm to fine. think of her having sex with another, you obviously seen it, you filmed it, but it doesn't ever make you insecure if she was fucking a guy like Nacho or, or Rocco, who are, like, guys that really know Dude. how to fuck. Even, <laughs> even in porn standards, those guys know how to fuck well. Hey, I'm, hey, I'm human. It's just something that I've, I've learned to block out. I've never been, like, a jealous type of guy, but... When we first got into the porn industry, I used to just do her. She just did other girls, and then I started doing other girls. So I pretty much talked her into working with other guys so I wouldn't feel so bad that I was, like, fucking all these other girls. And at first it did bother me, but it's just something that she, we're, we have a strong backbone in our relationship. So. Which one got to you, though? Like, which one? Was it Lex? or what, Like, which one did you go, like, God, she's really enjoying this? Ugh. Maybe the um, hockey player. Guys that I love. Oh boy! No, no, it's, no, it's, it, it's no, no, I don't think anybody really. It's the guys that are disrespectful. Like we go to work, we do what we do. Yeah, but that's but, different. What you, I like what Jimmy's uh, trying to do here. Like everyone has, I, I mean, everyone has jealousy, right? He knows. I everyone don't has like, jealousy. So like, who would if you, you guys, who would you if you guys bother? see each other fucking other people, and that doesn't really bother you, what makes you guys jealous as a couple? Or as a, when you say <clears> you as a married couple, like what really gets to you? Or being, I, I, I think, think it's more offset. I think one time he heard me give an interview and I said I was doing a magazine shoot and this guy actually made me come and it was during a magazine shoot where... No, no, he I, made you squirt. And okay. I, I never made her squirt, so I was like, fuck. He's never wow, made me okay. squirt. I said, so I said, like, why don't you show me how, to, how you make you squirt? I, I don't know. It just happened. But that made I didn't you jealous? Know, it did I make me jealous. I didn't it even kinda, know my body I kind of felt that. weird. Like, yeah. you know. All right, Gina, what makes you... Uh, what, what does it take to get you jealous as far as your husband goes? I, I don't know. It's been on and off. It's, it's certain girls. I think it's more girls that I, I don't like. If he's working with a girl that I don't like and approve, and it, especially if it's like like I, a skanky girl that he I has to work I think it's more with. girls that you get jealous that seem to have a... Like, we've been on set before. <laughs> girls are like, we got to hang out after, like, go out sometime. Right. And then they don't All right. realize that we're not swingers. Oh, and they're yeah. kind of like, they kind of cross over. So I, your rules I, for off-camera stuff are your exclusive. Right. Do you no off camera fucking with other people. Uh, uh, I, <laughs> okay. um, and I got to ask this, and no disrespect, but uh, porn star, what what uh, you said, skanky girls. Like a lot of guys would go, wow, porn stars are skanky, and I'm and I don't mean to no, be disrespectful. No, there, there, so, there's different levels of girls. Yeah, in the explain porn that because I there's A list girls, B C, and there's like nasty so there's porn girls. stars that looked at some of these other girls like what a fucking skank. What makes them a skank? I don't know. I, they're just, they just don't, dirty. They're, they're not as pretty and they will do whatever the fuck it takes to, you know, get paid for a scene. Mm -hmm. mm. So you, like, wait, so off, now, you guys consider But Travis cheating. likes the skanky girls. You so consider, that pisses me off. So there's well, you consider thing. cheating the same as anybody else considers cheating, though. Like, mm -hmm. if, if oh, you yeah. sleep with a girl off, off, uh, 
that's not on the clock say she, she would freak out you know on you what? as much as my girlfriend would on me. I have. She I've hooks. Never, she, she, uh, she hooks me up with. She brings girls. I have not brought girls home when we're in Vegas or we're, we've been on other uh, trips. Somehow it's happened where we're all having fun, we're drinking, and a hot fucking chick comes back to our room and we hang out for a while. And Travis ends up doing it. I do her, but you know I keep saying he owes me. <laughs> he owes me. <laughs> so if a guy's disrespectful to her, do you feel like did it tap into that thing like I'm a man, I should be protecting her? Um, and I can't protect her right now? Well, no. What, what do you mean, on set? Yeah, like, if there's, like, there's guys that I know that are on girls' no list because they just, they like to hurt the girls, they like to fuck them hard no, and they need to. No, I like that. I, because this is how I feel. We, we, we look, we got into this as a profession. Let's fucking do it right and make it good. I, I always tell her, do a raunchy scene, be nasty. Um, what bothers me is when we go on set, and we're sitting there in the waiting room, and this guy comes up and goes, "Hi, Gina, I'm working with you today." And then he's trying to like all like massage or kiss her neck and with me. be like, "Oh wow, it's like I've been such a fan of yours for so long." And all like, I mean, keep I that can, to yourself. You I know? can turn like, on and off as soon as the scene starts. I can. I don't even have to talk to my co-stars at all beforehand. Just look at their test, then go on set, and then I can turn right on and just do my like sexual performance. But doesn't it for a woman it's a little different though? Because the guy, it is. We, we, it you, is. you can't falsely lubricate. We can't falsely. I mean, without, again, without the, without cabbage, I, I, I fucking. I have to find the chemistry with the girl. Right. I mean, even and sometimes when there's not chemistry, I just kind of put myself in that place because if you know, I've worked with chicks before and they're like, oh my god, like what, let's let's quarter after, let's do forty five minutes, and it's, you kind of think like, yeah, like. At least act like you, yeah. like <laughs> sucking my dick, because it's not easy, you know. And when I go on set with strange guys, I don't try to. I try to be nice to them and don't act like I don't like them, even if I'm not attracted to them whatsoever. I, I try to just like work it so I can get the, through the scene and get it done quick. So you, uh, what? Does, does, now I get obsessed if if I know uh, a girl that I'm fucking has fucked guys with a lot bigger dicks. That worries me because I can't, like, I can give head well, or I could, but I can't. Make that happen. So does that fucking bug you, or because you're no. in, you're in that like category, yeah. you don't give a shit. It, it doesn't bother. It, if that bothered me, I wouldn't be able to do porn. <clears throat> you know, like I, I did a scene with her with Lexington oh, Steel. If I worried about that, <laughs> you know, I wouldn't have been uh, able to walk out on Lex, set. You know what I mean? Travis. <laughs> yeah, this oh. guy's twice the size of me. You know? Is he really? Yeah, wow. he's fourteen Lex inches. No, well, I, I. I dispute that. Maybe like 12 and a half. <laughs> Jesus. But still, you know what I mean? Fuck. When this guy pulls it out, flops it on the table, and I'm like... Oh, Did you want to just go look, forget the contract, here's your money, go well, home? Ron, Jer <laughs> Ron Jeremy's a big dude. I had to do a scene with a guy with Ron Jeremy. Ron Jeremy pulls out this big, fat thing, and the, the thing is, I came in, Ron couldn't stay hard, and I fucking blew the scene. Like, if it wouldn't have been for me, the scene would have sucked. Right. Because I was, you know, I did what I had to do, and then Ron's like, oh, well, if I lean back a little bit and pull my gut back, then you'll be able to see my dick more. And it's like, <laughs> and oh, I, meanwhile, God. I'm just fucking the girl, and I'm like, whatever, dude, this, you know, wow. don't rub your hairy chest on me. <laughs> what are you doing? Your dick's not working. <clears throat> well, he told the story. Uh, well, yeah, there's... The injections and shit. Remember that story? Yeah, yeah. That was insane. Um... You know, I've, I've taken Viagra before, but it's <laughs> I, the, the whole Viagra thing. I took it one time because I had to do two scenes in one day, and I felt like I was going to shit myself on set. <laughs> what a, that would be I had great. No, con, no control. <laughs> yeah. no, so no, I was no. just like, "Wow, man!" It's like <laughs> so, what a way to end the scene. Yeah, it's like <laughs> it's uh, a money shot. You hold on. I think I'm going to fart. <laughs> oh shit! I'm sorry. <laughs> so what was the story you had about? Uh, you dropped an N bomb. You know, he said. Uh, you know, he said it all to right. his friend. He um, said, "That's my nigger." And you said it. When did you say that you shouldn't have? Well, all right. I my dad's a missionary. I was raised in Alaska. Um, I n I never really hung out with uh, you know the African Americans, black people. Whatever. <laughs> yeah. Huh. I came down to Pennsylvania. I got a job in a lumberyard. We're all sitting in the lunchroom one time, and these guys were like, "We got to take you out." I was really naive. I didn't know clubs or anything we gotta take you out but i like the rap and the break dance and all. i thought that was really cool stuff so um uh, one guy says to me he goes did you did you ever fuck a sister and like i didn't know and i just i just said what do you mean and i said the n-word and, <laughs> and he came across the table and started choking me and and uh, two of my other buddies pulled him off wow and uh i was just like i seriously i didn't know what the fuck i did wrong i had no idea but that's, you know, I learned my oh, life. Oh, shit. 
They taught me. I was, you know. <laughs> I <was> schooled. <laughs> but, yeah. Got schooled by that. So, all right. That's very interesting. To, to uh, the next topic. Well, no, I, I like to know about the jealousy thing, because uh, I get fucking so freaked out by a, by a girl. Yes. Let, let me, let me, We've been let me tell you. Ten years or yeah, but you know what? That's not even it, because I have a lot of friends that are jealous. A lot of people always ask me this. Your girl's with you. If she wanted to be with somebody that was bigger dick, she'd be with them. You, you, I think you got to just appreciate that she's with you and loves you and not worry about that shit. Yeah, I know. It's an insecurity, and it's not, it doesn't. It's gonna. It doesn't hurt anybody else but you. I, I I look at women and I think that they view men the way we view them. So it's like uh, my girlfriend's like, no, I like fucking you. I don't want to fuck anybody else. And I'm like, I know you do. Like I send her pictures of other guys. Like I know you want to fuck up. Like I just. Oh I'm my taunting god. Her. I'm You're a insane. fucking. I'm a crazy yeah, person. Yeah. You really send pictures? Well, yeah. We talk dirty about her fucking other people, which I kind of like. Right. And I'll challenge her too. So like, you make so you... a specific person that you think she wants to fuck? I'm just out of my mind. I didn't say it was healthy. Uh -huh. <laughs> That's crazy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, you know. <laughs> How is it so quiet? Yeah, that's kind of crazy. Yeah. <laughs> you're feeding. You're feeding your. It's almost yeah. like I like. My therapist told me that I like to. Uh, you know, we all like to avoid hurt, but we, we figure it's going to come, so that's a way of controlling it and mm. making it happen, so you have some element when, of control. Over when it. I masturbate, I it it's really weird, but I think of him cheating on me. It's a little humiliation. And like like almost walking into it, but it turns me on and it just. Gets my thing going but, a little bit more. But she caught me jerking off one time and f fucking lost it. To I had a, a so I nasty had, girl. She I, was disgusting. I had a, You're fucking her in the ass in a picture. That was gross. And she's not even hot. And he was masturbating it, to the picture? At least fucking jerk off to a uh, hot fucking girl. I was editing. <laughs> I was editing on my computer. And yeah. It was, <laughs> and he was like always going through a bunch of pictures. <laughs> And oh, I was, <laughs> I, I was editing. I had it on the computer. Me fucking her in the ass, and um, I thought she was in the shower. <laughs> no, I, 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 no, had no, I had, I had the lube. Now I, that I, when I'm in the shower, I'm like, Travis, I'm coming out now. Please stop jerking off. <laughs> I had a bottle of lube sitting there on my desk and paper towel. You know, <laughs> I'm looking at this shit. I didn't even start. I was just like, you know, just kind of stroking a little bit. I'm like, Fuck, he wasn't full force. Scene. This is a good scene. It's good to know. Next thing you know, stars jerk off. I got yeah. my dick hanging out. Next thing you know, like I didn't even hear her. she walks up. Oh, she goes, "What are you doing?" I'm like, "Oh, sh I'm like, uh, it's getting ready to jerk off." I didn't think it was that big of a deal. She fucking lost. She goes, "Why are you jerking I off?" I think to I her? punched him in the face. <laughs> Who's the girl? Wow. Um. No. Why you fucked her? Yeah. Why? Yeah. Daniel Derek. I don't know her. I pop yeah. Her, pop her Put it this way. I shot her two times. The first time I was really sick, and she liked anal. She's dating a cop <clears throat> in New York, trying to hide it, one of those things. And she walked off the set. She goes, that was nothing. That was easy. But I was really sick. So I was like, all right, I want to rebook really you in two weeks. And then HBO came down to do a documentary. No bullshit. My guys had to carry her and put her in her car. I fucked her shit up. Like, okay. her ass was so <laughs> fucked up. All right. Because in my head, I was like, all right, you know, you think it's that easy. And then I just got this craziness. Of they, had to, they had to fucking carry her. Uh, like but, the old man in clockwork know, arms going, yeah. Yeah. And then she did to ass to mouth. I had to edit through the whole scene because it mm. was for Gene Allen Productions. Uh, and, <laughs> and I'm going through the scenes, and I see, like, him pulling out of her ass. And there was all kinds of stuff. And then sucking on his cock. And like shit all over her mouth from her own ass. Did she really have fucking? Oh, uh, Cause she leaked all over the place. Really? Wow. I, I, it was kind of like, sick, oh, but hot. And I go, this you know? is what you were jerking off to. <laughs> and it's this girl up here on the screen. That's her. Yeah, that's her. What a trooper she is, though. Yeah, the boobs are a little weird. Yeah, they are a little odd. <laughs> The, oh, you know what? I, the only reason you know Travis... What? I don't was, know if I should say this, but... The only reason when Travis was jerking off to her because he got to fuck her in the ass because he can never fuck me in the ass. Oh, oh you know what? Yeah, and that's true. That. That's true. She won't do anal, so... Oh, shit. It was a picture thing. of him, like, plowing her in the ass that you know he was that. jerking off to. Travis, you, you said, I don't know if I want to say his <clears throat> Yeah, I'm going to say it. Because yeah. this girl was... one of the. the I'm, I'm fucking this girl in the ass, and I'm, like, smacking her in the ass. I'm being really rough. I'm squeezing her ass cheeks, and her one ass cheek fucking shot off to the side. Ew. And I, it freaked me out. I'm like, whoa, what the fuck? She goes, oh, I got ass implants. And she really didn't have an ass Holy anyway. Holy shit. She didn't really have much of an ass. So I was shocked that she told me she had ass implants. I'm like, what? damn, I can only imagine what you had. Oh, yeah. Oh, see? See? It moves over. 
Holy fuck. <laughs> yeah, man. She that, does. Yeah. She's got like ass and it was, implants. And it was still a tiny little ass with the implants. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but, yeah All right, you see that asshole right so there? That shit was three times was that big. I that he was jerking off to that. an ass cave, did you, Travis? <laughs> <laughs> Good boy. When <laughs> I, I shot my load in her ass, and then I pulled out and waited for it to run out. <laughs> and when it ran out, it was like cream shit, cream shit. Oh. It was like a parfait. <laughs> I've, see, I've seen a lot of nasty stuff, but I was all, I was kind of like, Oh, little dry heaves and shit <laughs> on that but one. That's wow. still what you jerked off to. Yeah. Hey, would you ever do a scene with Max Hardcore? No. 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 All right. Uh, no. He's in jail. Is he in jail? I only got convicted in Tampa, but is he I, actually in jail? I think they got it like two weeks ago. Um, he surrendered. Does that worry you too? <laughs> yeah, it does. You know, because it's kind of there's so much other bullshit in this world that they should be worried about instead of stuff like that. I mean, if you don't want to watch the, that kind of stuff, don't. Don't buy it, you know. What was the obscenity conviction for? What uh, scene? Max does. Max puts speculums and you pussies and. Yeah, I don't know. I just don't. Say yeah, anything. I don't. I don't know the exact. Mm. But they, they try to get the people for the squirting and the pissing on one another and stuff like that, you know. So. Good clean fun. Yeah. <laughs> All right, we got to take a break here. We're running out of show. And we what, by the, the way, are you guys promoting? David and Bobo. Free uh, ones. Free ones. What's free, What's free ones? ones all about, Gina Lynn? Um. Where's your yeah. really? What happened? Well, <laughs> huh? What happened? Uh, oh, freeones.com. Uh, <laughs> all right. It's a... Uh, it, well, first of all, your clothing line is at SkinPa. No, it's SkinPA.com. Well, SkinPa. Skin people, P-A, uh, yeah. Skin, yeah. S-K, S-K-I-N-P-A.com. SkinPa, SkinPA. Mm. Uh, freeones.com. It's a free adult and celebrity site with over 12,000 girls in their database. Jesus. Exclusive photos and video galleries. And... Um, Oh, you're gonna you're managing him when he boxes. I know, he is gonna kick some ass. All right, that fight is April third. Yes. In the Philadelphia airport, Ramada. Jesus, what are you fighting the Ramada in the Philadelphia <laughs> yeah, airport? Yeah, that's what I in said. The fucking lobby. <laughs> that's what I uh, said. Uh, <laughs> no, it's actually <laughs> like a really big Two black entourages. Thing. Just fucking, um, thank you. Um, I had higher hopes for that one too. I didn't expect yeah. it. That's all right. Uh, you can get tickets eight hundred six seven seven eight four nine nine, and that's April. Uh, April 3rd, Travis Lee Boxing, um, the guy from Survivor. I hate that show, so I fucking hope you really hurt him. He will hurt him. He's going to and, kill him. All right, very good. But, um, hey, I want to make sure I get your contact so I can send you some uh, good uh, interracial shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah I'm into this shit. Like you know, you got really quiet. You, you like, your feelings got well. hurt, and you got really quiet. My no, feelings no, no, didn't no, get hurt. No, my, I, I was quiet because I didn't want to hurt nobody's feelings. You're not going to hurt and nobody's feelings. No, but I, I, I will. And and the thing is, I don't, I don't even want to. I don't even want to. It's. I'm telling you, just I'm not even. It's not even like oh. I'm just saying. You might get happier after you see my girl's ass. I'm I'm happy now. <laughs> <laughs> this is just nigga shit. And explain to white have, people how I feel. Hey, this this ever, is not King Kong. I'm, have I'm you okay. ever gone on freeones.com? There's so many different girls and affiliate programs that that's, you can go that's on. That's not what it is. Well, I, we know. I Let's know. go to commercial. It's all good. I have one question about Lex. I hear Lex is pretty uh, pretty traditional sexually. No no ass or any of that stuff. Won't eat ass and stuff. He ate my pussy. Well, yeah, that's why I said ass. Uh, and I think he kind of licked up in there. Oh, did he? It's okay. like a smooth lick. Yeah, here he's pretty like pretty fucking uh, pretty straight laced for a porn dude. I don't know about that. Okay. All right. <laughs> Patrice is going to be at Bananas in Hasbrook, Hasbrook Heights, <laughs> yeah. New Jersey tonight and tomorrow. Yeah. Uh, we're all going to be at Comics tonight, 14th and yeah. uh, what, 9th Avenue? 14th and 9th Avenue for the funniest uh, listener. It starts right. at like 7 Yeah. 30 and just don't offer Anthony home remedies and don't fucking see Iraq and yell hey fat Iraq right. it's only going to embarrass him and make him feel we're bad we're going to have a good time down there tonight yes. All right, we're going to take a break when we get back it's uh, the Dave and Bobo show everybody the second installment of the Dave and Bobo show uh, a quick 15 minute little radio show from these guys stay there the David and Bobo show this is unbelievable I cannot believe they are giving you valuable fucking air time pick a topic I could do a hell of a lot better job than you could, David. You think you could? Anyone could. It's the David. If you don't shut up, I'll proceed to hang up on you. And Bobo Show. This is the Dave and Bobo Show. All right, good night. Good uh, mid midday or afternoon, whatever it is. I guess middle between morning and afternoon. 
Well, this is the David and Bobo show. Yo, yo, show. what's up, man? David and Bobo show, Friday afternoon. How's it going, guys? Bobo, what's up, man? How you doing today? Everything's going great. Everything's going great, David. Yeah, yeah, you excited for the big weekend coming up? Yeah, excited, excited for the big week, excited for the big weekend. Got any big plans this weekend? No, now this weekend, unfortunately, there's not really, there's not really much, much, uh, much planning this weekend. No? Alright, man, but we got a lot of stuff going on in the world. Actually, you were bringing up some one, inter one interesting topic that you were, uh, talking about just a minute ago. We were doing some prep, bro, but what was this topic you were bringing up about, uh, some woman in, uh, in England, wanted to televise her death. What's going on? Yeah. Well, why don't you explain this to the fans? They don't. No one knows about this. I never heard about it. Well, explain. Well, well there's some some broad, some English broad that was on the English version of the show Big Brother. Right. She uh, she's very terminally ill. Like she mm -hmm. she's pretty much definitely gonna die. It's inevitable. Okay. Um, and she wants to document the end of her life on a reality show overseas. Really? Yeah. The the, the end of her life. She wants to document it. What are your thoughts about this? Do you agree with this? Do you think she should do it? Do you think people would want to watch this? What do you think? Give me your opinions on this. <laughs> well, <I> have... <laughs> <laughs> All right, now well, back to you, Bobo. Well, 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 I have to admit that this is this is going to be interesting. Seeing this, the the someone documenting the end of her life. Well, what the, it's really seeing the stuff that's going to happen. I definitely agree. That's crazy stuff. I mean. If she's live on TV, you just, they're just going to be focusing on her on her deathbed, just sitting there and watching what happens to her? That's n n well, she's going to document this stuff. Well, I guess basically it's going to go like, I, I don't know how, but they're going to be following her life, the, the, her last days of life, whatever she does. I mean, what do you think about that in terms of like, do you think that would, like a lot of people would be offended or a lot of people would want to watch this? Do you think it's going to get good view, like ratings? What do you think? I, I think a lot of people are going to watch this. You do? Okay, hold on there for a minute, Bobo. We're gonna go to some callers right now. We've got a Will on mine too. Yo, Will, what's up, man? Hello? Yo, David. Hey, David. Uh, what's uh, up, Will? What do you think about this lady dying, David? What do you think, David? What do you think about this lady dying when she dies? How is she gonna die when she dies? I don't know how she's gonna. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> I want to hear your thoughts on this, David. What do you think, David? Bobo, what do you think, Bobo? Bobo. Who are you asking? Are you asking me? Are you asking me or are you asking Bobo? Me, me, me what I think. You need a fucking retard. Me. Watch you. Okay, Bobo. Yes. What I think, if she wants to do that, I say go, go ahead. That's what you say, Bobo. Okay, great. The call, the number to call is eight six six wow one wow eight six six wow one wow. You got there, Bobo? Y yeah, I'm there. All right, cool. So <laughs> the point of this topic is that I really do not. Think this will go over well. I don't see a lot of fans, or even fans of Big Brother. Like, I mean, they might have known her from Big Brother, and they might have wanted to watch me. They might have enjoyed her on the show. But in terms of televising your death live on national uh, TV, I think that's a bit too much. I don't think a lot of people will turn on and watch that. You really want to see someone just sitting there rotting, dying, like being sick or whatever they're doing, and you want you think a lot of people want to like see that on the air? Well, I don't think it's going to go over well at all, Bobo. That's just my thoughts. Well, well, I'm not sure if I'd want to watch it, but I'm sure there'd be whatever sick Fs there are would probably want to watch it. There are a lot of sick there are a lot of sick people in the world, aren't there, Bobo? Yeah, there are. Hey, I've seen hey, I've seen people that like to get their asses kicked by their own girlfriend. Right, but they don't televise that shit on air, do they? No, but that but heck, that would make excellent TV, though. You think so? You think a lot of people would watch that? Just some girl crack kicking the shit out of a guy? You think someone would watch that? Yeah, take uh, argument to the next level. All right, there. Hold on a minute, there, Bobo. We've got Tom on line nine. Tom, what's up, man? Hello, Tom. You're on. Yeah, it might be nice to say Tom in Chicago. David, have I a said Tom on line nine. Tom, you're on the air. I said. Have a fucking opinion of your own. Every three seconds, you're asking Bobo what he thinks about it. What do you think about it? You. Dumbass? I just said what I thought about. It. I said I think it's a horrible idea, and that no one's going to watch that darn show, and it's going to be a failure. And I don't want to see someone rotting in a bed dying. I said that. That was my opinion. Okay, you you're asshole. I said that. Moron, how am I a moron? I gave my. Radio. How am I a moron? I gave my fucking God. opinion on the show, on the on the air, on the show God. about what it, I think about. It. How's that? How am I a moron? Because you have no fucking opinion about anything. How do I not have an opinion? I gave my opinion about what was going on in the... Were you dropped as a child, David? What the hell is wrong with you? I gave my opinion about what I thought about the, that show not doing well and no one watching it, alright? Why don't you go suck a dick, fat so, okay? I gave my opinion about the show, and now I'm asking, I'm asking Bobo about it because it's his story. He 
he researched and he brought it up. It's his topic, and I'm learning about it from Bobo for the first time, all right? Then have a conversation about it. I am having a conversation about it. I'm asking him about it. I gave my opinion about it. You want to come here and do a, pick a topic and do a story about it? Do you? Hello? That's right, you hung up. Good for you. By the way, we should acknowledge that we are on two countries, U.S. and Canada, and I think parts of Mexico, but unfortunately, they don't have the Alaska thing that they covered. So sorry, Miss Palin. No, no, uh, no except for you. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so basically, it's basically like I was an asshole that call, and I think that I personally did give my opinion. I think that show will bomb and will be horrible. You got anything else on your mind there, Bobo? Anything else you'd like to bring up besides that story? Well, I would like to break up that the spring training has just started. Spring training? That's baseball you're talking about there, right, Bobo? Y yep, that's right. I that see you with the Mets hat. You're a big Mets fan there, aren't you, Bobo? Yeah, of, co of course, as I said before, I've been a huge Mets fan for years. All right, hang on there a minute, Bobo. We've got another caller on the line <laughs> like to give his uh, voice. we got Mike on line four. Yo, Mike, what's up, man? Hey, uh, hey, Bobo, you should drop this Nick Dick uh, Barbarian. Hey, uh, yeah, David, let the Schwartz be with you, you Jew. <laughs> <laughs> all right, that's very not, not very funny at all. Not one bit. Continue, Bobo, with your uh, Mets spring training. Well, yeah, it is the start of start spring train, and I'm hope I'm hoping I don't have to deal with the a second year of a collapse in a row. Right, that is true. Uh, what are your opinions on the Mets? I hear you're a big Mets fan. I see you always wearing that Mets cap. You're a big supporter of the Mets, there. Yeah, I have. I've been a big supporter since I was a kid, and yes, I am excited about the upcoming season. What are you excited about there for? You have a certain like fan of the uh, like a certain player that you like on the Mets, or are you a big fan of like David Wright or maybe yeah, yeah, Elgato? Yeah, yeah. Who's your favorite Met? And my favorite Mets been the uh, David Wright. David Wright, what do you like about David Wright? I think he's a good third baseman. He can get hits for power. He can get a lot of home runs. What do you think about him? Yeah, yeah exactly. I, I love the way the guy shows his enthusiasm playing on the playing on the team and the and being there on the being on the field. All right, hang on there a minute, Bob. We got another caller on the line. We got James on line six. James, hello. You're on the air. David. Yes. What's up, man? Will you please do me a favor? Depends what it is. Get the fuck off of my radio, please. Please. Who, is it to you? Who are you to tell me what to do? Um, well, just like ONA, just like everybody else, I could do your show better than you. Oh, sure. Well, so why don't you come here and do it right now, then? Uh, I'm in fucking Kentucky. You so drive over, here, drive over here and come do a show. Holy shit. Well, hey, let me ask you something. See, I called the other day. Are you there? I'm listening to you, jackass. Hey, listen to me. I called the other day, and uh, it was about you uh, fucking with some chick on uh, the internet. Yes. So, uh, what's going to happen whenever that guy comes and confronts you? Are you going to, like, hang up on him, too, you pussy motherfucker? What the fuck are you talking about? That guy's not going to... That guy... That, that guy was just here last week. Yes, that's right, Bob. But we saw him. He didn't confront me at all. He didn't care, give a shit about me messing with his wife. We were just uh, messing... We were just uh, flirting, and it was a no... It was a joke. Oh, was it? What the hell is that noise in the background, you asshole? <laughs> My child. You know, I've gotten pussy, so I have a child, you know? Good for you. No one cares about your get. children. You would never get. Hey. Hey. Yes. I hope you die of AIDS. Good for you, man. I get Good for you, man. I could do this all day long. I'm sure you could. Great. Yes, I could. Good for you. You're dumber than the motherfucker in front of me that can't go on a green light. <laughs> If you don't shut up, man, I'll shit in your fucking mouth, you dipshit. <laughs> oh, man. So, Bobo, you were talking about the Mets there, weren't you? Yeah, yeah, that's right. I was talking about them. All right, but uh, I think that's enough to talk about the Mets for now because we got uh, some guests around here on the show. We got to introduce our... Uh, our big uh, guest that we've been having the whole uh, day. Why don't you give a little shout out to the guest there, Bobo? <laughs> All right, we got we got we got a G Gina Lynn, and she and she's uh, got got a clothing line called called a Skin Pa. It's yeah, if, if you go to skinpa.com, skinpa.com, you can see my clothing line. And I have Try, one of my Bobo. Models. You see one of my models oh. here. Yeah, I see this one of your models. April. Yeah. But, hi, April. Hi. <laughs> Talk to him. Good talk, Bobo. <laughs> Do you have any questions? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Any questions? How 
How'd you, how'd you get into the industry anyway? Uh, well, the clothing line is is not porn, but getting into the industry was a long time ago dancing, but everybody knows that. <laughs> yeah, I know, but, how, but how'd you come up with the idea for the, for the clothing line? Um, I actually modeled for them for eight years, so the, like, silhouette on a girl. <laughs> I don't know if you ever seen a silhouette. You ever seen one before, Bobo? Yeah, it has like yeah, yeah, like my boobs like that. Whoa, Bobo! Yeah, yeah, what are you yeah, thinking about? Yeah. Wow, how about yeah, that? That, that? That's about a nice. That, that's a nice set. Do you want to see her set too? Show what the you do, Bobo. Show, ask her, the ask her. Show, show the goods. Show the Stand goods. Up. Stand up. Okay. <laughs> wow, Bobo. What do you think about that? That's pretty good there, huh? Yeah, it's pretty nice. Yeah, it's a nice set. <laughs> what would you like to do with that, Bobo? If you had, what would you like to do with that? Oh, I'd like to go right between those, if you Come know on. what I mean. Come on, Bubba. Come right between us. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> read that. Read that card, Bubba. Read that card that I just gave you. Oh, I'll read it. Let me see some. T let me see them titties. I think Bubba would like to see them. He's very excited right now at the moment. Whoa, there he goes! <laughs> Describe what you're doing. Okay, okay. Right now, uh, the two uh, lovely uh, models we got going over here are taking their clothes off. Bobo's getting a little anxious here. He took his glasses off, yep. even. And he's going and run, running up to them. And he's in between them. He's, now he's bending down here, sitting on the chair. Yeah, take that. I think you take the, take the hat off there, Bobo. Take the hat off there, Bobo. <laughs> right, I'm ready. You put the mic up. Whoa! Yep. Holy yep. smokes! He's right, I'm right between them. For those of you fans that are not here and can't see, the stars are just rubbing their tits on Bobo's face. Roll up in there, in his face, there, Bobo. Yep, He's that's right. Away. Yep, yeah, that's Bobo, right. why are you running away? Are you no, scared? Don't no, go away. No, they're, not, they're not done. No. They've got a couple more minutes to, All right, to go, Bobo. Done. Yeah, I'm right, be right between them, and damn, that that feels great. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Whoa, whoa, whoa! They are rubbing their tits right in the face of Bobo. Wow. Yep. <laughs> Wow, Bobo, right. how does this feel to you, Bobo? Describe this experience, please. Are you kidding? It, fe it feels great. Have you ever had any tits rubbed on your face before <laughs> like this? Ever? Is this your first time? What are you... Uh, yeah, yeah, that's pretty much the first time. Wow, wow. What do you think about it? Do you think you'll want to do this some more? Try to want to feel this experience again? Of course, yeah. Wow, that's incredible, Bobo. I can't believe it. Hold on for one minute. We've got another caller on the line. It's Mark on line four. Yo, Mark, what's up, man? You're on the air. Hey, uh, hey, David, what are you doing, David? David, what do you think about those tits, David? Hey, David, David, do you like hearing your name over and over again, David? David yes, I do like hearing, hearing my name over again, actually. That's, I appreciate oh, that. Great. But, David, can you... I'm trying to explain for the... Can I make a conversation, David? I'm not trying to make a conversation. I'm trying... I'm trying to say something, David. Just saying something. You know what? Fuck you, mother asshole. I'm not trying to explain. I'm not trying to make a conversation. I'm trying to explain to the listeners that are not here at the studio what exactly is going on now, what these stars, the porn stars are doing to Bobo, because no one can see this. I'm trying to give it a, a visual explanation so everyone can see that. You got a problem with that? Do you? Hello? Hello? Are you there? Oh, I forget that guy. Forget that guy. Continue. Proceed. Yeah, proceed. I meant to say yes. Thank you, Danny. But you're, what I was saying is that yeah, these, these guys, these guys, the, these broads' tits, they could, they could, they could, they could, they could wake up the dead with their tits. <laughs> Maybe your friend wanna like switch seats with you. Hey, uh, you want you want to switch seats? Come on, come on, it's great. Switch seat. Yeah, should I? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right. All right. Yeah, definitely. All right. Definitely, I'll switch seats. You now, you now, Bobo. You gotta explain what's going on to me, Bobo. And you, you, you explain, and you ask me the questions now. Bobo, is that a hard one you got there? Of course. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm kidding. I'm sorry. That was great. Okay. All right, now. All right, Bobo, explain. All right, the she, she's a the the she he's a right between them. All right. You, Bobo, continue, continue. Right. Bobo, you gotta direct the scene, Bobo. You tell. You know what? How about this, Bobo? You say what you want the stars to do to me. You give them orders, Bobo. How about that? Bobo's gonna give the orders. We're gonna do a little more. Can you take your glasses off. I think they're. Whoa, they're, they're, Bobo! They're, explain what's going on. They're making out right now. They're, All right. They're making out right in front of him. Okay. What are we doing? They're, tell us what to do. Bobo, tell them what to do, and they'll do it. Are you two make out right in front of him? 
and then go ahead and feel free to remove the glasses. Oh, oh, me. That's me you're telling. Okay. All right. Whoa. Explain, no. Bobo. You're, oh, you're they're, commentating. They're, 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 they're making out of right now. Right now, now you two go, go, go remove the glasses. Okay. Well, well you know what it is. You, 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 you know, guys see what he says. Time. Right. Relax. Okay. I'll hold your mic. I'll hold All right, your sounds good. mic for you. All right, All right sounds good. No, feel free to let, let, let okay. a motor... Let him uh, motorboat. Let him, let him motorboat your your okay. rats at the same time. <laughs> okay, whatever you say. <laughs> <laughs> He's motorboating them. He's a better director. <laughs> yes. He's, he's motorboating them. Oh, we gotta do the whole smush thingy. Well, but you explain what they're doing. Wait, but then right now they're 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 like cli they're like climbing on him right now as we speak. They're climbing on him right now. You ready to motorboat? Yep. Go. <laughs> 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 Whoa, whoa, whoa. Remote one at the same time. The chair, chair looks like it's almost falling. Whoa, whoa, explain. <laughs> that sucks as a motorboat. I know, it was bad. It was very bad. <laughs> okay, all right, all right. He's uh -uh. really getting. He's really <laughs> getting it. He, he's oh, getting sorry. it. Ready? Right now, now, turn around. Now, now, Gina's taking her. That's her turn. All right. <laughs> all right. All right. Now you two go. Go Come ahead on, and grab. Go, 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 go ahead. Go yeah. get. Go. go ahead and grab his dick. <laughs> Come on, now go ahead and grab his dick. Whoa! 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 Grab his dick. Bo bo both of you at the same time. Oh, okay. Well, all right, if he's giving the orders, all right. <laughs> I don't think I'll be Yeah, I think I'll be right, right, right there. Right over here. Right. Okay. No, grab his dick. No, no, no. no. I don't know where it's at. I think it's right here. <laughs> Let's see if I can find it. Okay. I, I think you two need a magnifying glass to find what? it. What? Come on, Bobo. Magnifying glass. That's a little harsh, don't you think? A magnifying glass. Oh. I'm just Remember, playing with you. You have to make it look big. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. There you go. All right, Bobo. Explain. Keep going. All right. They're, 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 gra they're grabbing. <laughs> Yes, go on, go on, go on. Or at least they're, at least they're trying to. They're, they're I'm trying to get you a little excited through your thighs, okay? I'm they're, they're, okay. They're, 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 they're trying to get excited. I'm starting to get, starting to get excited there, Bobo. Okay, lean back. I'm going to grab your cock. <laughs> Let's make it a cock right now. All right. But they're, 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 trying, they're trying to get it. They're trying to get it. I guess, I guess they forget. It's there. It's there. It's there. I'm trying to get excited. <laughs> Bobo, give some look. they nervous. Look, they like... He looks like they want to throw throw up. Is, is he th is he throwing you off, giving you direction? No, that's the whole point of the show. I want him to give the direction. Oh, does that turn you on then? Uh oh, maybe a little bit. Maybe, maybe someone else giving me the direction does. Yeah. What, what turns you on? Hey, Tell Bobo, me. what should I do now? <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Should I spank you? I go. Go ahead, do it. Should I take right. your belt off and spank you? No, I don't know about that. No, no. Come on, do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Okay. What are we going to do now? Put his hands on that. He's lost. Okay, direct him. <laughs> okay. Hit, spank, spank, yeah. hit, spank, hit. Bobo, give some directions. Come on, go. Go ahead, go ahead. Yeah, spank, whoa. hip, spank, whoa. hip, spank, hip, spank, whoa, hip. Whoa. This is going to be wow. Okay. <laughs> Come on, you been a, be. come on, you been a bad boy, David. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Ow. Whoa. Courtesy of freeones.com. <laughs> Here comes the hard one. Ow. <laughs> come on, come on, come on, let, come on, come on, let, come on, let America know you, you, you really, you really right, want it. Down, down a little bit more. There we right. go. Ready? Yeah. All right. Oh, woo! Woo! <laughs> wow. You like that? Oh, I like that. It's pretty good. Oh, I like Tell that. me how much I like it. Our new bit. Our new bit. Be a Jew. Ah! Green harder. Ooh, I like that. I like that. It's pretty good. Is your right cheek a little jealous? I think so. Oh, I think you need to switch up a little bit. Let's get it out. I'm going to bend them down bit. this way. Ready? Okay. I'm gonna switch up a little bit. Eddie? Crack that yeah. Oh, yep. Okay. <laughs> what is this? Do you have another other underwear? No, oh my God. <laughs> I'm all, we need you. Red, I'll stop. Mom, we <laughs> need you to have a red ass by the time you're done. Ah, wow, that is oh, actually that's weak. You better hit it. No! Ow! Ow! Shit.
<laughs> Let's see the cheeks, David. Yeah, that, that actually did hurt. Oh. Oh, man. Wow. I can't read that. What did you say? <laughs> I can't. I, I read it before for a minute. Yeah, wait. wait. <laughs> oh, Bobo, I'm so hard, Bobo. Wow, that really was turning me on. Oh, Bobo, wow. Right, looks like right. Thanks, ladies. You, looks like our ladies did did their job. Did her, did, her, did their job. Bobo, would you like to get would you like to get spanked with a belt? What do you think about that, Bob? I think hey, we what? should give it a try. Hey, what like the heck? Go ahead. Okay, okay. All right. All right. You can use it. Yeah. Stay out there, yeah, you're you're to sleep. Okay. Oh. oh, oh, he's he's in position, man. Like Bend over. You gotta like 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 pull it out. Like. Him. Arch your back. All right, right now, out. right now, uh, the stars are trying. Are, are proceeding to uh, spank Bobo in the ass with my belt. Whoa. Whoa. I think he really likes that. I think he does. Whoa. Whoa. Mm. Whoa. Harder. Whoa. April, harder. Whoa. Harder. He wants more. <laughs> it's not good enough for him. Tell All right, let me try and beat this oh, bitch. Holy <laughs> shit! Give it to me, you dirty girls. Give it to me, you dirty girls. She's getting whipped in the ass by the four. Whipped in the ass by the four. You know you want to give it to me, you freak. Holy shit! Let's bring his bare ass down here. Oh my god! Bobo is getting his ass. Oh my god! 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 Oh <laughs> if anyone can feel it, Bobo is getting his ass spanked extremely hard with my Hope belt by the porn star. Oh my goodness, Bobo is taking it like a champ. Wow. Holy smokes. Oh, Holy smokes. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> Listen to the crowd. Ready. Ready. Oh, Holy shit, for those of you that can't see oh. Bobo's, for those of you that don't know, ah. Bobo's pants were just pulled down, ah. his pants and his underwear are pulled down, his butt, his butt is showing, and <laughs> with that wind, ass and his, yeah. holy shit, oh my god, him, oh my god, 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 I can't believe what I'm witnessing right here, Bobo's pants are down, his butt was wet really hard, and he was enjoying it, I think he was taking it like a champ. Holy smokes! Yep. Wow, Bobo! Wow! Oh my yeah. God! I can't I'm believe okay. what I just witnessed right there. Oh my God! Wow! <laughs> That's when it feels the best when it's purple. Okay. Wow! Wow! You just wow! That was just the most incredible thing I've ever seen in and my that, life. Well, and, and that day, it's how it's done. Wow! Thanks a lot, Bob. You really did show us how it's done. Wow! <laughs> <laughs> wow! Well, that was quite a bit. Bobo, tell me, how did it? How did it feel when the when the bell was getting onto your ass and you were, and it was being your ass was being spanked? How did that feel, Bobo? Explain it. I know the adrenaline easily eases out the pain. Whoa! Holy smokes! So you're saying you enjoyed that? Yeah, that that's what you gotta remember. Do you like the kind of like sexual experiences, like with the torture? Real quick, do you like that torture? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay. Yes, yeah. you do. Well, okay. Well, this has been the David and Bobo Show. Uh, I hope everyone enjoyed it. I know Bobo certainly had a good time. Thanks for listening, guys. We'll see you next Friday. All right. I think a lot of people are just getting used to this because this is just a new thing that they're, they're just hearing. It's the David and Bobo Show. The virus.